All right, here we go. Let's play. All right. Here we go. Let's tier list this real quick. We have Rust Fiat Engineering, which is S tier. Sagawa Mechanical, which is F tier. Crimea Agricultural, which is B tier. And Saxony Patriotic, which is B tier. Sure, we're actually playing it. Looks like we're playing it. They're just going to camp out on Patriotic and let people bid for a little while. Stay on Rust Fiat Engineering for now. Bid 20 on Tagawa. Thanks, Brian. Some really solid advice there. I mean, everything's going to go higher. It's got to. Okay, 15. Now we're getting a little steep for Russ. I mean, maybe not. Maybe kind of expensive for Saxony, but probably not better than Crimea Agricultural. But, I mean, let's face it. Who's going to let me have Saxony and Patriotic for three in this matchup? Nobody. Or four. I have it for four. Jeremy takes Crimea Agricultural up to seven. No one, no one bumped her off of Rusty and Engineering, right? He's just trying to bid it up so he can take Tagawa. No, he is. Ah. All right, so seven, seven lower than Rusty and Engineering with Crimea Agricultural. Too low. Can end too quickly. But I really don't want a 16 coin bid on Russ. Saxony sounds fun to play, honestly. I think that's motivating me as much as anything. Ryan, realistically, how high do you think the bids will go before Tog gets picked? Maybe like 18 for Russ? A few coins higher for the other two? I'm not sure. Although Ali's thinking about it. If it ends now, I think Jeremy got a good deal with seven on Crimea Agricultural. Gosh. I don't want to play high bid Russ. I just really don't. Yeah, no bad. We got... Gawa Mechanical. Oh, Durr got knocked off, but he's not ready to end it yet. I'm not sure Crimea Agricultural's better than Saxony Patriotic in this matchup. It's just... Saxony Patriotic needs two good objectives, I think. All right, Durr, here you are. You know you want Tog. Do you want it yet? Not yet. Okay, it's to me. Do sax pat. There's a lot of coin there. Might get lucky with the objectives. I mean, agricultural goes up to 10. Wander, you know you're, gonna, you're the one who's going to end this. I mean, I might take it if everything goes to 12. Everything's got to go higher, though, I think. <laughs> Uh, so Russ Engineering is just five above Crimea and Saxony, so I got to take that. The problem is Russ is getting up there to where if you end in the 50s, like can Russ cover seven on the other two? Yes, but if you end with the 50s, that's like, like 32 and change. You've got to have Tagawa under. It starts to get kind of iffy. Sax is fun. Saxony Patriotic going last is going to be slow. Now, this is the time to take Tagawa, I think, if you're there. Not yet, though. Kind of want to get bumped off. Oh, I don't get bumped off. Not yet. Dur takes it right. I think Dur just doesn't want to play Tagawa. For me, Ag is really close to Rust Fiat Engineering right now. I want nothing to do with that. Nothing at all. Adjust the, the lighting a little bit, guys. What do you think? All right. Uh, do this. Is it enough? Maybe. Maybe not. Let's have some fun. I'm going to have to do this on the fly.
All right, let's do this. Um, we're gonna start with a trade to metal. Yeah, I've got woodpecker strat, but I, I really wanted to try mine. It's actually adapted from an Albion mechanical strat. But I'm going to have to do the adaption on the fly, I guess. Be standard with Rust so far. This is going to be imperfect. I mean, what I really should do if I was going to make the Mac when I want to. Albion starts on food and metal, so I don't start on metal here, which kind of messes me up, and I can move this to metal and this to metal as well. Then I don't get my character out. Who are we kidding? And I have to move. I probably should just go with just gone with woodpecker strat, but there is a this is the sa standard Saxony opening many of you know double upgrade move deploy, bolster deploy Use for oil on turn two. This is different though. Let's see how this works. You can do it. Got Dur on Crimea. Gonna build. That's a shock, you know. Dur never builds. Higher ground, I guess, in. Theory, Despise Warmonger could happen, but I, I feel like it's unlikely. What do I want to do here? Five workers? Go ahead and get over here. It's gonna be a while before Saxony can touch touch me. Um so the recruit is really expensive. Do I the only question is do I want four metal or two? I think the answer is four. Um, take the power trap here. Much danger if I, I am not much. Throw down the pop trap. Get a little clever here. Okay, so let's think about this. Gonna need three, six, nine, twelve total metal for the max, right? And we have six. So if we produce on metal, let's assume Yeah, we'll be fine. Basically what I'm gonna do is put Really gonna produce to five workers. What we get here two resources for Saxony. He's gonna take some metal.
Township. That is interesting. Spend some of this metal. Running out on the board. Right there, but it's only round five. Right? There's enough wood for a building now for uh, Crimea. Okay, there's an underpass out of Saxony. Hmm. Going all out on the factory here. Two max. No enlists. An interesting strategy. I have good combat cards, so that's nice. I don't want to get blocked off this village for, for, by Saxony. Well, I think I have to move. I don't think so, actually. I'm going to take the risk. The Saxony doesn't go to block me this turn. I want to produce one more time. Oh, Russ has machine over muscle, you think, climb? Yeah, that would make sense. Factory card and three workers. Yeah, you called it. Hey, Wales, how's it going? Ooh. Yep, Saxony doesn't move. I doubt Rusfiat does. Oh, I need the upgraded move, don't I? This recipe had attacked me. I steal all my resources. Probably not. Nope. Going for an encounter. Oh, two food, two food. Nowhere is three food. That's okay. He's going to get some upgrades. Next. Produce, in fact. He'll get some upgrades. Okay, so do we need the, we actually need the upgrade? I, I need, I have four metal, I need three more max. So if I produce four times, that's eight metal. That's one metal short. If I bring four workers here and leave a, a metal there. I gotta move. Can't keep sitting on that crap trap. Mm. Shh. 
speed Mac. Go to three metal as Saxony off of a trade. Now, if Crimea was coming for me, he would have gone scout. He didn't, so he's not. No one can hit this metal right here. One, two, three. Right, no, no funky shenanigans with Township are possible. Take power for Tog, and we have decent combat cards. Let's see here. Wales, who's playing which combo? We've got Durr on Crimea. We've got Ali on Patriotic. We've got... Me on Tagawa and Jeremy on Rusviet. Bids are on screen. And Climb just said all that. Also on screen. <laughs> all right. The attacking Russ. Ooh, aggressive. Six. Six workers going to be on oil. There is experimenting this round. got to build a mac i mean there's no way there's no way i'm going to leave this move and leave saxony saxony could flip two traps and take all these resources so yeah that's not going to happen ooh this goes all out oh gosh So who's the threat right now? Crimea, obviously. 15 bid. Then eight, but there's Scout. Pays three pop for Scout. That's a nice bargain. Do I take Shinobi? Let's see where he puts his Mac. Hmm. Yeah, that was painful for Russ. Uh, that looks kind of aggressive out of Saxony. Seven and four. Let's uh let's drop Shinobi. Unless Russ wants to come play, but I seriously doubt that. And he had the upgraded enlist too. He's gonna take an enlist off of this. So Crimea still can't well, Crimea could go to the tunnel and attack me. But I mean, zero card, one power, Crimea doesn't want anything to do with me right now. Sax is going for Crimea, 100%. I mean, give up one card against Crimea. They have one power. You know what the card is? Oh, and he gets the food off the encounter. He gets to take an enlist. That's nice, isn't it? 
All right, Sax can flip two traps and take these resources if I don't do this. So I'm doing this. And we'll go Shinome. Or we won't. Us is right there. It's right there. This is the part where Crimea enlists, right? Grab a card. Five power, one card. Not nearly as vulnerable as Sax was hoping a minute ago at one power, zero cards. All right, Saxony. I have Ronin. I have a trap, a lot of power, and I have a five. I imagine Rust will move off this spot. Oh, he's going to block me. That's unfortunate. Why? What does he gain from that? I mean, he slows me down. But he can't take the character to the factory this turn. Do that. Right now, I think... I mean, isn't the big threat... Yeah? Maybe not. I don't know. He's got a 15-coin bid and a 9-point lead. Now, why does that happen? What do we take now? We move, right? Oh, this is going to stay right there. He's going to play one power. I could be smart. Play one power. Save a power. Did I do it, guys? Hey, I did ya. Nah, I'm going gonna, gonna to play the two, even though I knew he was just going to play one. <sighs> power. Let's coin trap this. Four down. Not really sure what the plan is, but I'm only down by four. I'll just start handing Saxony combat stars, right? So let's see, three more 
enlist produces. That gives me five metal. Move to here and here. Seven metal. Is that right? That's enough. Okay, Crimea is moving in position to go to the factory. Russ is going to five workers and setting themselves up for another mech, probably to move those workers out. <laughs> They're going to build, yeah, but I'm not going to get tier. Go to four cards. We got two fives. Ooh. What objective did Russ have? Russ had machine over muscle. Really interesting start. Out of Russ. Me up by twelve. And good on that fifteen coin bid. See what Russ does. We want to go take Russ's metal. Oh, Russ misclicked. He gain a coin. What do you do? Oh, he consolidated all the resources. Oh, but he's going to get some power, right? Up to five cards. I can't fight him now. Uh... Crimea move this turn and go to the factory. They can. Let's send the character home. Yeah, I don't have Shinobi yet, do I? Been nice to go to there, wouldn't it? I think Saxony flips two traps. Hmm. I have two fives, so I can afford to do this. Gotta send Crimea home at the rate they're going. They can't get a factory car. They're still just two moves away from the factory.
They did take a five. It means he's going to play. He's not going to expect me to have two. He's going to play power. No, I'm wrong. Oh, well. Mm, yep, classic scout. Figure. I have two combats. I'm only down by three. I'm nowhere near six stars. I have four bottom reactions in turn 12. That's Tagawa Mechanical, right? I think I pull out Sutan now. I'm just assuming Saxony doesn't, you know, like rip two traps to get a combat and steal all my resources. I don't think he, and he doesn't. He's gonna wait till he has disarm. No, he has disarm. He should really attack me there. That was an easy combat for him. I'm not going to get to the factory of this game. So what am I going to do on my off turns? Trade for stuff? I don't know. It's going to be a while before I have off turns. I guess I won't. I have got to start thinking about how I'm going to get three mountains. This one, I guess, I could take, and maybe this one. Sutan Shinobi. What was this pop and cards? Zach still doesn't want to hit the card trap. Put it here. Yep, Crimea with just two enlists. Wants to build buildings. Going all right, score wise. I don't know when or how I'm going to end, but going all right, score wise. I think I need to take a turn to upgrade now. <laughs> For me, it doesn't have pop to produce, he says. Whoops. does Crimea have uh, more power than me cards and I don't need any more combat for me a move though yeah just move where Sax is on the factory now so I think that was worth a turn to slow down Crimea The five bottom row actions and 13 turns. So what do we want to upgrade? I'm going to trade for two oil this turn, I think, and upgrade move. And I guess deploy. Then it's 
we could always do produce, save some turns, but we're going to need that upgraded move. Ah. <sighs> For me is still thinking about this. Eh. You're gonna go attack Saxony on the factory? Hix. Got a combat, eight workers. One metal, he could uh, get his last Mac. Everything but Shinobi. Oh, he can't even trade for Pop because he traded last turn. Can't get an encounter. He's this is kind of a kind of a rough turn for Crimea. Oh gosh. Okay. I think I upgrade deploy. Because if I upgrade deploy, the next two produces. So I produce, upgrade, deploy, produce, have my enlist star, bolster, have my mech star. Oh, he's, he's been up here in force, huh? Let's take the card, move on with life. I didn't really need that mech there. No good cards, can't win this fight. Probably should have waited a little time to lock in just to make him think I was thinking about it, you know? And I get a three. Isn't that nice? Scout OP. But by 10, just needs 15. But unfortunately for him, who can't produce? As long as nobody builds. Nah, he doesn't even have, doesn't even have that. So gonna produce and trade for oil, upgrade, move, deploy, produce again, have the enlist star, get the mech star, and then we'll start moving to try to get an objective. Hide for the most coin. Thankfully Crimea is not in a position to end. Us can't produce either. Us can't end this game. Mia can't end this game. Axony's playing a long game. This is, I don't want you want to see us Tagawa mechanical, I guess. I mean, I guess I'm still up by five. A couple stars for Crimea. Oh, and. Oh, right, and he gets power. How lucky is that? 
How lucky is that? Come on, give me something. To... Nope, another two. I mean, I have my combat, so I don't guess it's such a big deal, but it'd be nice to know I could hold some territory. And stall a bit. Um, need the pop? I don't need the pop. Ah, uh, yeah, that was a nice encounter. Very lucky indeed. Five. No, like, eleven ahead of criminal. Do the bids. Jackson, you making a move here? Probably still wishes I was wishes I was still there. Sure. Saxon, you gonna play three cards here? Why would you not attack right here with two units, two v one? And use the third move to like grab an encounter or something instead of going 3v2. And he brought metal. He's not messing around. Gonna disarm Crimea. Really throw three cards. That's good though for us because this place suddenly becomes safer. Because what I'm thinking is I'm gonna upgrade move and deploy. Produce again, get my enlist star. Oh. They both came to play. Wow. Oh, and Sax loses. He brought the metal. Just gave Crimea metal. Oh my gosh. What does Crimea have? Two and two? I can't hit him anyway. I don't know why it matters. I was going to take the factory from Saxony. Is Rusviat in the picture here? I mean, I guess they could be. Yeah, they're in tier two. Got three max. Three enlists. Crap ton of cards, too. Still got five cards. I still can't take the factory. This is at 42, which is nine ahead of me, but he's got to beat me by 18, so I'm still up by nine. Got to drop out of tier two. Okay, there's the produce from Crimea. All right, I get a star this turn, a star the next turn, then a move action to spread a little bit. Then another star. Oh, that sets me up to get my last star as the worker star. I don't like that. Bit game though, so it might be okay. Oh, I can fix this, though. 
Take this metal. Get a little spread. Yeah, there it is. Uh, Russ is going to end in a few turns. Up by 14 right now. I don't need the metal. I need Rust to not win. So what does Rust do this turn? This turn Rust trades for two food. Moves. Get a combat and end the game. up by 16 it's gonna be easy for him do I move or do I produce into an enlist um Move. And let's take the resource because why not? It's away a little bit of points from Russ. Only up by nine. Three stars is still enough. This can get trade for... Oh no, they don't have four metal, so they can't trade for food. They have to produce it. They don't have people's army. Me, I'm gonna run away. Some power. This doesn't have the factory card up. It's actually moving back out onto the board. Ramea here is vulnerable to Rusviet. Last combat. Here's a, a mountain I can take. Next move, I move this Mac here. Three workers here. Maybe this here. Go fight Russ. Russ can't end now, though. Crimea is too close. Uh, Crimea is just three off. Russ can end. No more food. Combat. I 
People's army, there it is. Just need a food. Can't steal it anywhere though. Got to 44. Me with the Mac. Everyone but Russ. Saxony. Saxony has no combats. Everyone but Russ has their two combats. Hmm. Russ could always go for this uh, encounter, get food off of it, while they take your combat. Twenty-three coins with Tog Mac in turn seventeen. Four enlists. I'm not going to move to this village, obviously, because I don't have Shinobi, so I'll go over here. Or, I mean, I'm right there. There's some big bids right now. I'm about to pick up some territories. Thing is, Russ, if they brave this trap, would be the pop trap, especially since I saved it for last, right? They have the cards to win the fight, even if with the power trap there, but it's the pop trap, it's devastating. Yeah, Russ has done quite well. Can Russ create enough distance is the question. Oh, that was the factory card. And what? Run away? Go fortify the factory? Not suicide into Russ. He's up by seven. Two stars is eight. Fifteen. Gotta move. Bump some rust stuff, I guess. Is in the combat if he wants it, but can he make the score? Got to make up three. 
plus 18. He's going to make up 21 on the last. Can't take that much away from me either. I didn't move him back here, so I have to take this. And I, yeah, I can. I don't think Russ can do it. I mean, I could be wrong, but be a 21 point swing. The problem is I just don't have that many territories he can take away. Oh, this is another mountain that I could take if this one up here doesn't work out. Saxony in position? Not really. Attack Tog, please. Where though? Probably up there would have been good. Hmm. What are you gonna do, Russ? Yet? I'm actually ahead, even without the bid. We get 10 coins out of two stars. It's true. Still needs 21. I mean, that's hard if you already have the factory. Where do you get the, where does he get the combat anyway? Right here. We're here, right? He doesn't dare flip a trap. Does he have the math? Can't possibly have the math here. Unless he's just forgotten it's a big game. I mean, make him pay something. This is going well.
Russ needs six plus 18, 24. And needs like 16. Combat win, yeah. Russ uses the factory card. Why not, I guess? One power, for the heck of it. Oh, and I get a five. He's up by five. Needs 13 more. Can do full spread. So I can pick up one, two, three territories, get my objective. And hide my metal so no one can stop it. How to do that? Not take my five this time. It's the thing is Russ has to spread one more star in tier two. Actually, he needs to take the factory. I'm going to go to 56 and then 59 with the star. It means Russ is going to have to pick up 22. All right. No one's going to stall me. Someone either ends to win or I win. <laughs> How much do I have? Four? B. During it? No. I mean, I've got 59. All right, where are the traps? That's combat card, right? We could hit that without any real consequences. That has consequences. Oh, okay. Kermia going to do that. Well, he has to try something, right? Got an upgraded move action. That could be an objective. Just, he's nowhere close to the points he needs. He 
needs 15 to be like three. Let's think about this. Russ could get one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 11, 12, 13 for the star, 14, 15 for the coins. Uses two to spend the resources, just 13. Uh, where else does he spread? Pop to give. Bump this. Three, six, nine, twelve. It's the star. Sixteen. It's the coins is eighteen. Basically, someone needed to stop me. Knock me farther down for Russ. Saxon even hedging in Russ a little bit now. He has zero pop. Counter not going to make much of a difference. Russ can't spread quite as much now without fighting. Let's see if Jer Jeremy's got it in him. And really only take one territory away from me without stepping on traps. He's just got to step on traps, right? Yeah, that's true. Saxon can't actually attack me. Unfortunately, the pop trap isn't either one of these. One of them's the coin trap, though. So if Russ flips that, it's still in that game for him, though. He gets three for the territory. I lose two. That's five. He loses two, four coins. That's one. So he could pick up three, six, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 12. Not sure that was the that was the play at all. All right, power's a tiebreaker, so let's spin five plus a four card. Um, yeah, to have as much as Saxony, Saxony's not in the running, as much as Russ Fiat. Not enough. Enough. Oh, he loses two points. Spend. In coin bid. All right, that's a win. Down by 15 on Rusviet. Oh, 21 turns, 18 coin bid. The other factions weren't close. 
But if we're doing the math, we've got Tagawa at 53, um, Rusviat at 50, uh, Crimea at 40, and Saxony at 36. So good game, guys. Um, managed to pull out a big game with Tagawa Mechanical. I was going to end in turn 21, but Rusviat took that away from me. I'm a little disappointed by that, but it is what it is. It's still a win. Uh, let's, uh, let's get some other games going.